Hi guys, welcome to my first ever unboxing and here we have the Samsung Galaxy S7 the 32 gig variant um, as you can see it comes in black onyx so uh, it came from smart actually under their postpaid plan okay so without further ado Let's get unboxing. First, you, you feel the, 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 the premium box here. Samsung has done a great job in giving us this premium feeling box here. Here we have the um, seal from Smart. I don't know if you can see that but uh, there so let's open it up and here we see the book type box right here and we're greeted with a gorgeous device Okay, let's put that aside. It's a box right here. Uh, oh, with the SIM card ejector too. And inside is uh, documentation, paperwork, warranty card, etc. We got the micro USB cable, the power brick, and an OTG dongle. It's kind of nice of Samsung to include this 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 dongle. You can easily plug it in in your device, and then your stick use USB storage on the go and then here we have the what's this headset it comes in white <laughs> thought it's black would have been great if Samsung included a black one but I'm not here to complain Okay, so you also get two extra ear earbuds in case you lost this one. Okay, so here's the device. It's a black onyx device. Um, it's a 32 gig variant from Samsung. I up to get the S7 instead of the edge variant due to safety reasons I also believe that edge screen is more prone to damage once you drop it let's fill this plastic now another premium looking device Definitely a step up from the previous Galaxy S6 with a um, with this curved edge on the back, and then the still the all metal build. Okay, let's put it up. Oh, we have the micro. Oh, sorry, the nano SIM and the micro SD card slot on the top. I don't know it's okay the volume rocker on the left side and the power button on the right it really feels light actually let's put it up
okay there's the smart logo there actually I'm surprised I thought I will be greeted with the home or home to call this welcome screen where I can easily set up the device from scratch but given it's it came from smart uh, it's preloaded with smart apps or bloat if you will so there you have it um, stay tuned for my full review of this device as well as hopefully a comparison with the Nexus 6P and there you have it thank you for watching my first ever unboxing video and if you like the video please leave a thumbs up and subscribe and hope to see you in the next one thank you